Hello guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel of The Concept Guy and a very happy new year to all of you and I hope this year will bring more and more learning to you as well. And so in this video, I'm going to discuss about my COPE offers. COPE is a common offer acceptance portal that occurs after GET results are announced and this portal opens up to give you various opportunities from mtech from iits so i will tell you today my gate offers like after gate offers in the cope offers what all iits i applied and got uh, selected in and how the different rounds went what opportunities i got and a very bonus tip at the end that is a uh, an excel sheet where different people have mentioned their offers and at in which round and at what score so a lot of things in this particular video so watch till the end and i hope you will get a better idea of what offers in which round at what rank you can get through gate so guys first let me just tell you about what offers i got in cope um, cope is common offer acceptance portal if uh, after the gate is gate results are announced so gate results were announced on 15th march 2021 and it was such a tense moment at that point but after the result was announced and i got i secured a rank of 243 in the general category in chemical engineering and i will tell you first that how after that everything needs to be done i just focused on the top iits because the rank was better so first uh before this scope whole thing and applying over here first we you need to visit different iits portal like for iit bombay we can just type in iit bombay and mtech admission and 2021 so they each and every iit has their own admission uh, platform like this for iit bombay and here you can actually get all the details and all the applications and everything like for iisc it started in march itself and for iit bombay delhi madras and others it was around during the period of april so you need to first find out which all iits you need to actually apply to my rank was good so i applied in iisc bangalore uh, iit bombay iit delhi iit madras iit kanpur and iit kharagpur so these were sufficient for me to uh, get an offer but still i will tell you like in the round four of cope uh, i actually had no offers in the round four of cope uh i actually had no offers yes in the round four of the cope 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 is common offer acceptance portal i really had no offers and i was quite much tense so i will tell you about that story too but first after the year results are announced you just apply to those iits where your chances are high and you want to go into and after applying that the play applications uh, generally end uh in the month of april and in fact in some iits like iit bombay delhi it, it just gen generally un ends in like the mid of the april so after the gate results are announced just uh, be uh, just careful that you don't miss the last date of applying to these iits and then after applying to the iits that uh, that were actually of our reach of my reach then i went to the common offer acceptance portal and then here we need to just register and after registration they they also actually put some like action flowchart where you can see how these things work but let me just tell you overall in a very easy way what really happens is that cope or the, or the common offer acceptance portal works on like round basis so in the first round you will because all those iits you have applied to your offers won't come over there they will first be reflected in the core portal and then in the round one you will get some iits so three options first is the freeze and then the retain and wait like you retain the iit you can actually retain up to two uh, rounds retain and wait and then the reject reject means completely rejecting the offer so and after rejecting it won't actually uh, come up in the later rounds so first offer i the first offer that i got was iit kanpur and iit kharagpur and i retained both uh, among these like between these two iits this, these were the first offers that came uh, because my rank was 243 general so it it was obvious that i would get iit kharagpur and kanpur and all the iits below that below that so 
because I was also of general category. So I first I got IIT Kanpur and IIT Kharagpur. Next, uh, and I thought to just retain the IIT Kanpur offer. Uh, I retained the offer, and all these scope rounds, everything would be occurring around the month of June. So the June is the main month in which the scope or common offer acceptance portal gives you the offers. But before that, you have to register it in the month of April itself, and also individually apply to different IITs portal as well. Then I had applied for like Kanpur, then retained the offer of Kanpur, and then this in the second round it again gave me Kanpur, and Kharagpur was not there because I had rejected it and I had retained only Kanpur. So in the next round uh, only Kanpur was retained and no new offer was given so I was still okay like let's wait for the third round and I hope uh, Madras or Delhi would come up and now the third round uh, also now this is the main like third round was the most important round for me because in the third round also I got IIT Kanpur as well like it, it was in the first in the second I in the first I retained it in the second I also retained it no new offers and in the third one also, IIT Kanpur was the only offer that I had. My rank was 243 in general category chemical engineering and I was still having only IIT Kanpur as an offer in the third round of COPE. So at that time, I had to make a very, very crucial, a very, very important decision that should I reject or should I accept because you can only retain up to two rounds. And so the third round, I had to all either accept IIT Kanpur or reject. And you know what I had, why, what I did. But trust me, like at that moment, I was like, okay, let me just reject it. I will get better options like Madras and Delhi and even Bombay. So I was quite tensed. And at that in that round, I was thinking, will I really get a better IIT in the next rounds? So I just placed my bet. It's the Coop portal is seems like a lot of like gambling type but but that is the main thing like okay let's try my leg luck so in the fourth round after i had rejected like in the third round i rejected it kanpur and in the fourth round like i was shocked like huh no offers so i had no offers in the round four fourth round of cope and i i had to cope myself okay so like it was quite tense like uh, I rejected IIT Kanpur itself in the third round I could have taken it and my parents were also telling me that uh, take it take whatever you have IIT Kanpur is also good and it's it's, it's still it's really good but I was like let's just uh, get a better IIT maybe so I had rejected it and in the fourth round like I was totally lost and I was totally like demotivated I was like wondering if I could have taken IIT Kanpur in the first place itself but then I was like, okay, ICT and the ICT like was something that the applications for I'd say ICT started around like mid of May and in the June, uh, around mid June, after the fourth round, I had the uh, ICT was in the during the fifth round of COPE, same same date. Okay, so in the fifth round of COPE, I got the offers of I Delhi, Madras, and Bombay of engine uh, energy energy studies of Bombay and chemical engineering of IIT Delhi Madras and also I got the offer of ICT as well ICT means Institute of Chemical Technology so I had three offers now in the fourth round I had zero offers and in the fifth round I have three offers now ICT is from a different portal let me see ICT M Tech admission 2021 and this they had a different portal altogether so you had to apply and the offers for ICT they will put a merit list out there and in the merit list in the they will have their own like zoom meeting kind of thing and in that they, they will tell you like they will prepare a list a rank list merit list and then ask the first rank if if he or she wants to join ICT program of that M Tech. then ask the second person if he will like to join and that way their counseling goes and at the end i i was in the top uh six or five and i easily got the seat so now i had three offers iit delhi madras and ict mumbai and i had to choose which one to go with or 
maybe if i could reject and get bombay in chemical engineering but that was the fifth round and i had to go to the spot rounds then the abc and i what happened in the round fourth of scope i was totally nervous that if i could get no offers in spot round this would be a complete failure for me so i went with uh, iit delhi as you all know and finally chemical engineering in iit delhi excel sheet here here in this excel sheet you can find different rounds first round second round third round fourth round fifth round and the spot rounds as well and also the category and the ranks of the students the, their scores and also their branch and name as well and their option what they did retain and wait retain and wait and at the end you will see most of the accept and freeze and which iit is option i had also entered my uh, offer here let me just show you um, 243 this is me uh, this one in the fifth round i did the tick mark so guys i hope you like this video and got to know the various offers and you can just tally and check the various offers that other students also got and i hope you like the video and share and subscribe this channel also and i hope you get a better idea of how things are and how op how much opportunity opportunities are there in mtech from different ideas and what you can get at different ranks thank you guys